So it was me and my husband's 12 year anniversary. Uh, February 17, 2012, I got married to my daughter's father. Okay. I had planned for this. I like bought the tickets in like November. So I was in Las Vegas, Desert Hope, for like 40 days. Desert Hope is a um, drug treatment facility. Okay, so you were in so a facility. So I'm in recovery, right, okay. right. Okay. So the program that my husband's in, he couldn't get out. So I had my daughter fly in from LA and go with me. Okay. So I live next door to this nice shop. It's like Disney World. It's really, really nice. It's called Pink. Wait, wait, wait. So before we get there, I want to know more about this concert. Who's performing? The Isley Brothers, Black Street, Genuine. Okay. Color Me Bad. So just R&B night. Right. Romantic. It's a super love jam. That's what yeah. they call it. So you wanted to get all dolled up. Right. You see this salon that nice looks salon. nice. salon, yeah. That's what got me in there was the salon. So you go in and you say you want to get the works, right? Right. I told him what I wanted, okay? She said $135 deposit now, $25. Both of them, Jasmine and Coco, did my hair, but Coco was training Jasmine to do it. Neither one of them had license, I don't think. Okay, we're going to get there. So you go in to get a relaxer, a, a color, color treatment. And a style. Just to clarify, Jasmine is not here, but Coco is. That's right. the uh, defendant's witness. Yeah. Why do you think she wasn't licensed? Usually when you go in the shop, there's a, there's a, um, their license, you know, is on, on the wall. Her credentials are on the wall and you right, don't see any. Right, right, but I, the shop had me so amazed so I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> Ms. McNeil, right, let's look right, at this right. shop. I want to show everyone what this shop looks like. So this is Pumpkin's One Stop Beauty Bar. Where was the name inspired from? Like, where did it come from? Uh, come to the legacy of my daughter. She was killed in 2000, so I came up with that for the beauty salon. Did you used to call her Pumpkin? Yes. That's okay, name, that's sweet. All right, so here's the salon. Very nice, very pink. Right, if you can see, there's no credentials on the wall. So, okay, well, let's <laughs> just settle that. <laughs> oh, Lord. Ms. McNeil, are your stylists credentialed? Yes. Are they licensed? Yes, ma'am. Would you hire anybody that wasn't? No, ma'am. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and just put that issue to rest. She's lying. We're gonna move on. Is this a picture of the final product? Or no, final that's results? what my hair looked like before I went in that shop. Okay, well, what is this picture of? That's what they did. And you didn't like this? No. Did you make that known to Ms. McNeil? That you no, I happy? didn't. I just said, it's, it's okay, I gotta go. Just let me go so I can get dressed. Ms. McNeil, what did she say when she left the salon? She was happy. We had pictures of her walking out the door, grinning, scanning. We were having fun. <laughs> grinning and scanning? I mean, we were scanning. Is that an evidence? I mean, why is we here? Are these the pictures? Yeah, them is it. They had now, a lot of is... other pictures that they're not showing. Hold on, hold on. That's a big smile. Yeah, I was happy. It's my anniversary. I'm going to the show with my daughter. Of course I was smiling. I understand that the defendant, Ms. McNeil, you have a video from the time that she... Before and be after. Before she got her hair done? Before she got her hair, that's there. Mm -hmm. I yeah. And then after, and we're gonna get a reaction yes, from her in the video. Okay, absolutely. Let's, let's watch. Please show them. She getting her relaxer, rinsing it out. That don't even look like my head. <laughs> Do that look like your head? Yeah, that's my head. Mm-hmm, absolutely. See, I don't have my purse. Why, why do you record? Because that's a little odd to me. I record because that's part of my marketing. That's part of my business. So you're I just open, use... my okay. grand open, so that's part of my marketing to take pictures as I go. And you asked her for permission? Yeah, well, no. yeah. Yes. No, she, she didn't know didn't. they were... Nope, she didn't. She didn't. And why is she showing the pictures with both of them doing my hair? They should have showed Jasmine on there, the one that did my hair. She took Can my money. Hold on, pictures where she walked in, how we prepared her hair, how we took time and took care of her hair. Can you say she looked like she was less acute? Yeah. It doesn't matter what my hair wait, looked wait. like when I, when I came in there. Well, what hey, matters is... Ms. Jasmine no. Curry, what matters is what we think is important. So okay, okay. Here we go. Yeah, so I, it's you know how she you put came the cap in. on, right? <laughs> I did not come in there like that. I came in there with my, with my hair going back you took my she... cap off, it was laid down. She picked it out like that. <laughs> you know I didn't come in my hair like that. I had a cap on all night long. It was slicked back. She combed it out like that, then took a picture. Lord have mercy. Can I just sit down for a minute? 